the Honor X 9B. And I'm going to be talking about this phone is because of the extremely weird marketing that's happening on Twitter around this phone. Mother says it's gone on an online rampage about how this phone is shatterproof and that you don't need tempered glass. Ah, man, tall claims, tall claims. But we like to talk about phones on their merit and let's talk about what you can expect with terms of the specs, the phone has already launched in global markets. Now this phone is a very big 6.78 inch Full HD Plus curved AMOLED display and with a refresh rate of 120Hz and a peak brightness of 1200 nits as well. But the most interesting thing is apparently it's shatterproof. I think we should definitely test that claim out. Shouldn't we? We'll do it when the phone comes to us, but the phone is also expected to run on Snapdragon 6 Gen 1. And you can expect two RAM variants, 8GB, 120GB, but only one storage variant, that is 256GB. Now the camera setup on the rear is a triple camera setup with a 108 megapixel primary camera, 5MP ultra wide, 2MP macro camera, and on the front, you get a 16MP selfie camera as well. Whether the phone is shatterproof or not, what I am really excited to see is that the Honor X9B has a massive battery. It has a 5,800mAh battery inside. So I think that the battery life should be fantastic considering that Honor's operating system is actually very well tuned for battery performance. But in that price category, the charging speeds are slightly slow if you ask me, it's only 35 watts. Also another thing that could be a bit of a letdown for a lot of people is that it comes with Android 13 out of the box and not Android 14. Now this phone is also expected to launch somewhere in mid-February and expected to be priced under 25,000. If it will be priced under 25,000, then I think it could be a good value because it has some interesting propositions in terms of the bigger battery size, and maybe the camera performance will be good, the software experience should be good as well. But here's the interesting thing that happened in the past, like, you know, month or so. The Honor 90 was available for under 20,000 and a lot of people bought it and at that price, that phone is actually very, very good. Now the X9B, if it launches for under 25,000 and if the Honor 90 is also going to be available at that price, then I don't know where it positions itself.